And Steve, you're the emergency management director for the state of Oklahoma. I'm the emergency manager. I'm the. I work for Oklahoma Department of Emergency Management. I'm the operations manager. Operations manager. Now, how long do you plan on being set up here? What's the What's the estimate right now? We're looking uh, once we get done with our uh, initial uh, assessment. Well, we'll get, get done with our initial assessment, and we get our secondary assessment taken care of. We'll probably move out, probably looking towards Thursday, Friday. Thursday, or Friday. Mm -hmm. How big an area? Do you have an idea how big an area we're it's, dealing uh, with? Twelve right miles here? long. Twelve miles. And any idea of how many folks were affected overall? No, not not at this time. Not at this time. How many How many men and women did emergency management contribute to this effort right now? Right now, we have a team of we have a team of twelve here. We've got, oh, I believe, a team of thirty back at the office. That's amazing. That's amazing. Now, how, you're also out in Shawnee and Kearney. And we start out in Shawnee and worked Kearney yesterday, and then just got back to the office when this one hit, so we're back out here. So our staff's been running 100 mile an hour this weekend. Now, a lot of people don't know what you all are responsible for. So what is what is you guys come in and look at right off the bat? What's the what's the top concerns? Top two or three concerns that you all have. Our biggest, as emergency management. Our biggest concern is, is of course, life safety. Absolutely. And to come in and support this operation with any resources that they need to go ahead and take care of the life safety, safety aspect. Then we turn around and start looking at all the damages, uh, the individuals that were impacted, and we try and help them out any, any way that we can. And by bringing in FEMA support, any type of individual assistance support through FEMA, then we start looking at all the damages the city and the county have, uh, have taken on due to assessment with all the debris and how to help out with the debris plan and debris issues and how we can get them back to normalcy and get them back to moving forward again. That's amazing. Well, you do a great work for the community. You guys are amazing. Aside from being emergency management folks, there are also volunteer firefighters and a lot of reserve police officers. And, you know, these are people that really serve and really care. So a lot of people talk about government employees and they think we're just grabbing paychecks and looking for pensions, but it's really about making a difference. And, Steve, your folks out here are making a huge difference, and thank you so much thank for you. all you're doing. Appreciate it. Appreciate you.